future. If someone is famous, then everyone naturally assumes they must have existed. Winston Churchill, Adolf Hitler, Genghis Khan, these are figures who are remembered because they made a huge contribution to human history. Yet other well-known historical figures are famous despite never having existed at all. Myth, legends, and stories become so commonly told that people just assumed those mentioned and venerated within were real living beings. With that in mind, I'm Ben from What Culture, and here are 10 famous people who never actually existed. Number 10. Uncle Sam. He may well be the iconic image of American patriotism, yet Uncle Sam never actually existed, but his initials U and S are intended to personify the United States. USA! USA! It's believed Uncle Sam was the nickname given to entrepreneur Samuel Wilson, who supplied meat rations to American soldiers during the War of Independence, but it was first used in literature in the allegorical book The Adventures of Uncle Sam in Search After His Lost Honor. Number 9. Robin Hood and His Merry Men Robin Hood robbed the rich to give to the poor, didn't he? Well, he certainly did in countless literary and big-screen adaptations, but the likelihood is that Robin Hood and his band of merry men never actually existed. The heroic outlaw who resided in Sherwood Forest was renowned as the finest archer of his time and was said to steal from the rich in order to feed the poor. Interestingly, though, the terms Robin Hood and Robe Hood were often given to criminals as early as the 12th century. Despite the fact he appears in numerous poems and ballads from the 14th and 15th century, no historian has ever been able to prove he actually existed. Number 8. William Tell Switzerland's greatest folk hero is simply that, a fictional character. First mentioned in late 15th century chronicles, the precise marksman supposedly assassinated a tyrannical Austrian warlord named Gessler and gave birth to the Swiss Confederation during the 14th century. The story goes that Tell was so accurate with a crossbow that he shot and split an apple positioned on top of his own son's head in order to gain his own freedom. However, Gessler went back on his promise to free the prisoner and had Tell bound and taken on a ship. The legend ends with Tell then assassinating Gessler, and that this then sparked a rebellion in 1307, which gave birth to a modern-day Switzerland. Number 7. Donald Kaufman In the film adaptation, directors Charlie and Donald Kaufman are the main protagonists, yet there is one major problem in that the latter never actually existed. Charlie's twin brother, Donald, was actually a completely fictionalized character, even though he's listed as having written the film in the DVD's credits, which close with the words, in loving memory of Donald Kaufman. Portrayed by Nicolas Cage in the screenplay, Donald Kaufman was even nominated for a Best Adapted Screenplay Academy Award for his role in creating the film, becoming the first fictional character to receive an Oscar nomination. Number 6. King Arthur and His Knights of the Round Table King Arthur is Britain's legendary monarch who supposedly defended his kingdom against Saxon invaders in the early 6th century, aided by his Knights of the Round Table, of course. But nobody's quite sure whether or not he actually existed. Other mythical people who appear in the stories include Arthur's wife Guinevere, his father Uther Pendragon, the wizard Merlin, as well as the legendary magical sword Excalibur, whose owner was rightfully the King of Britain. Despite various historians trying to find historical basis for the tales of King Arthur, no consensus has ever been agreed upon, and it appears Britain's legendary monarch is merely a figment of medieval imagination. Number 5. Homer Greek poet Homer has become synonymous with the works of the Iliad and the Odyssey, yet whether or not he penned them, or more importantly, whether he actually existed at all, remains a topic of fierce debate. Some ancient Greek scholars claimed the writer lived around 850 BC, while others believe he was born earlier in 1102 BC. But many modern-day historians do not believe such a figure existed at all. Plato describes Homer as the leader of Greek culture, but even if he did exist, it's highly unlikely that he was the sole author of both the Iliad and the Odyssey, so the author of the first known literature of Europe may not have actually ever set foot on Earth. Number 4. Pope Joan The myth of the infamous Pope Joan lasted in the far-flung corners of Europe for centuries, but it's now widely believed that the female Holy Mother never actually reigned during the 9th century. Supposedly, Joan was a pious and talented woman who disguised herself as a man named John Anglicus, and, due to her undoubted abilities, rose quickly through the Catholic Church and was eventually elected to the papacy. Then, as the legend goes, Joan gave birth while riding on horseback and died shortly after. While this is largely unsubstantiated, what is known is that Joan's existence was not clarified until Pope Clement VIII officially denied the story in 1601. Number 3. Alan Smithy The second director to appear on the list, Alan Smithy has been involved in the creation of at least 91 films, yet he has never actually existed as a person himself. Instead, Alan Smithy was the official pseudonym adopted by film directors who wished to disown their own work between 1968 and 2000. I suppose you could say 
the films he directed were shit pictures for wackers. Hashtag shit pictures for wackers. Although the Directors Guild of America officially dropped him in 2000, he still claimed at least 20 film credits since as a kind of tribute. Number two, Saint Christopher. Saint Christopher is such a venerated Christian figure that he's often commemorated on necklaces and bracelets. Yet the third century martyr is probably fictional. Supposedly killed by Roman Emperor Decius in 251 AD or Emperor Maximus II in 310 AD, Christopher is remembered as the patron saint of travelers. Christopher, literally meaning Christ bearer, is believed to have carried a child who was unknown to him across a great river before the small person spoke and revealed that he was Jesus. However, this is likely to be based on a Greek myth and Saint Christopher is unlikely to have ever existed. Number 1. Prester John a legendary Christian king who ruled the Orient between the 12th and 17th centuries, Europeans believed in the existence of Prester John for more than 500 years. Letters were forged to prove the existence of this Oriental king who supposedly ruled over parts of India and an area which contained the Fountain of Youth, which if bathed in would restore a person to a youthful state. Despite the complete lack of evidence to prove the existence of a Christian monarch named Prester John, Europeans completely bought the story of the mythical king, and Christopher Columbus even cited this as one of the reasons he decided to pursue a life of exploration and discovery. Prester John was supposedly a descendant of the Three Magi, or Three Biblical Kings, and his realm was said to not only contain the gates of Alexander, but border the earthly paradise, or Garden of Eden, itself. And that's our list. Are there any we missed off? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. You can even follow me here on Twitter if you fancy. I'm Ben from Wad Culture, and thanks for watching.